Hello, this is Ben Coleman, one of your many hosts for the Florida Aviation Network. And uh, we are here at Reno. It's 2019, and uh, it's always interesting to see the folks that we're going to be uh, talking with today. And as a matter of fact, we have one gentleman here named Barry Cole. Hello, Ben. Pleased to be here. Barry, I know that you're pleased to be here, but you have no idea what you're in for this week because you're a rookie, and you're here as a uh, admin, grip, ground support, security, and uh, bouncer, you, you, and uh, and hay boy. Do you know what a hay boy is? I do. Are you good? Are you a good hay boy? I am, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, lieutenant. Uh, Barry, and show us your meatball. You mean uh, this meatball? Excellent. It's okay, that's covert, for Obi. Covert operation. That's for Obi. And uh, for all those that want to aspire to come to Reno and uh, volunteer for the Florida Aviation Network, we encourage you to do so. Coordinate with Obi. And uh, Barry, what we do here, and it's all with that thread of safety. And uh, with your background, uh, you flew uh, OV-1s, the Mohawk. I guess that was what you cut your teeth on. Well, that was my fixed wing uh, in the Army, OV-1 Mohawks and RC-12s. But I started off uh, rotary wing in the Army, flew Cobras. Mm. And uh, that was a uh, mo little more to my, uh, my uh, persona. You know. <laughs> well, uh, when you figure out what you really want to do when you grow up, uh, let us know. But will it, have, will it have anything to do with this airplane behind us? Well, I would love that. That's probably my favorite airplane that's ever been. And my dad and I, when I was growing up, uh, we talked about Mustangs. I've had the privilege uh, to fly a few of them, and um, it's it's the real deal. Barry, what are your expectations here being uh, a grip for the Florida Aviation Network? Your first year as a grip, you are a rookie. You know that. You are a lieutenant. I understand. Um, I'm just glad to have the opportunity to uh, to serve under you and to uh, but. Uh, to see what goes on behind the scenes as well as, I mean, obviously watching the airplanes fly around and the people with the airplanes, but to see what goes on that that they have to do to put this show of this magnitude on and do it safely and legally and hopefully nobody gets hurt or no airplanes get bent. Exactly. That's the whole bottom line. Uh, enjoy it, but but don't spill any blood. And have you met any interesting people while you've been here this, so far? I've met a few. Uh, some of them, well, interesting, but some of them border on characters. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's, uh, I owe a lot of that to you. Uh, getting to meet a lot of these people, uh, uh, it, it puts a lot of things in perspective. It is different on this side of the fence uh, when you're on the, in the inner sanctum, if you will. And we did go up. I took Barry up to the uh, to the head office. That when you're asked to report to the head office, it it is the head office. Well, it's kind of like going to the woodshed. <laughs> it's, true. it's true. It could be. Well, Barry, this is uh, early in the week, but uh, we want to talk with you at the end of the week and uh, see. You know, we're going to be a little bit more sunburned. And uh, we're, we're going to enjoy a lot more. We're going to meet a lot of people. We're going to talk to some interesting folks. And we're going to try to pull out that safety thread of, of what each individual team, both from Formula One all the way up to the Unlimiteds. And uh, we've got some folks over in Jet. Drop Bear is one of our uh, friends. And uh, Kraken, uh, they'll be, uh, they've got a camera on board uh, for the uh, Mark McGinn and his guys at Onboard Images. And we're going to develop a lot of good friendships here, and we're going to share this with our viewers and our listening public. And that's the whole point of this. And, and we're actually trying to get those about starting about right here up to get him them to his position in this industry. Well, I'm looking forward to that. And uh, you and I, when walking around today, we met a young lady um, that is one of the pilots and one of the young blood coming into this sport and uh, it's not just a bunch of uh, old rich guys uh, there's a lot of younger people coming in and we've got to have that in this sport as well as aviation in general if we're going to continue to have aviation be a viable career and a viable sport and something that uh, I'm so proud to say and you might agree with this even though we do a lot of things and we got paid money 
but I've never worked a day in my life in aviation. Well, there's a few days I thought I earned my pay. <laughs> but you had people shooting at you. That's the thing. That's true. But um, it's, uh, it's the most fun you can have with your pants on. And that's a good note to leave there and a bad, bad sight picture for Barry Cole. But uh, <laughs> we're going to let you uh, get back to oohing and on over your airplane here. And thanks, Barry, for your time. Thank you for the opportunity to do this. Let's do it again. Okay. All right. That's Ben Coleman, and uh, that was Barry Cole, one of your many hosts. And we have a lot more to spring and show you from uh, this 2019 uh, Reno Air Race. And what a great time. I have to pinch myself every now and then. And uh, Dave Block happens to be the cameraman. Uh, Dave, are you having a good time today? And uh, Dave, have you ever had a bad day of shooting? Maybe. That's a maybe. <laughs> All right. No kidding. Thank you very much, Dave Block, uh, for, your, uh, for your attention and your, your kind uh, generosity of your time. We are going to double your pay. I put that into Obi on the way out here. And uh, hope, Obi, hopefully you get this, and uh, we'll bump him up uh, a notch or two. Might be able to get uh, one of these someday for Dave Block, you think? Anyway, Ben Coleman signing off. We'll see you next interview.